hello friends in last video uh, we are uh, forgetting one thing so we need to add that thing so from next video we are going to create report uh, we forgot that to decrease the stock when we are going to create the sales form i am going to show you when we uh, create this form means uh, when we are going to sell this item on that time we need to decrease the stock quantity but we forgot that but no problem now we are going to add that it is very easy so no worry about that now first of all we are going to check the uh, stock quantity wheat uh, 10 kg and rice is 20 kg okay so now here we are going to write our code so first of all we need to create uh, sorry we need to define variable integer qty is equal to 0 and then we are going to take one variable name p name and now we need to we need to pass update query so for that we are going to take this and now before starting the update query we need to take quantity in variable so for quantity we need to take this drqty we need to copy this drqty dot to string so copy and we need to paste here convert dot to ind32 now we need to take p name so for p name we are going to take this product so copy and now we are going to paste here yeah and now we are going to pass here update query we need to update the stock table so here we are going to write update stock set product underscore qty is equal to product underscore qty minus we need to pass this qty variable where product name is equal to and here we need to pass single double double single and between plus plus sign we need to write p name dot to string and here for this qty we need to take this in double quotes then plus and then plus so we need to write query like this now you can see right now we have 10 kg wheat and now i am going to create i am going to sell this item and then we are going to check stock is decrease or not Ame and the pra build type case product width we are going to sell 2 kg and total 10 now uh, it is a price but uh, we are going to sell this 2 kg now add now save and print we can see record inserted successfully so we are getting bill but we need to check here I refresh this you can see the product quantity is 8 and yeah now here we need to start login form and we need to forward sorry we forgot to add the sales form inside MDI form so we need to add that but before that I am going to check you can see here not here not product not and dealer you can see we uh, forgot to bind sales form over here so now we are going to bind our sales form inside this product so for that you know we already bind lots of pages inside this so open this MDI parent now click on this now click here single click only and you need to write sales product now double click on this and now we need to write sales SS is equal to <coughs> P 
new sales then ss dot show so this way we can bind our form here that now inside this sales form we did uh, decrease the stock quantity you need to write code here thank you so much for watching my video if you like my video then please like it and share it maximum thank you so much again